12 step devotional step 8 forgiven to forgive bible reading matthew 18 23 through 35 we made a list of all the persons we had harmed and became willing to make amends to them all listing all the people we have harmed will probably trigger a natural defensiveness with each name rewrite down another mental list may begin to form a list of the wrongs that have been done to us how can we deal with the resentment we hold toward others so we can move toward making amends jesus told this story a king decided to bring his accounts up to date with servants who had borrowed money from him in the process one of the debtors was brought in who owed him millions of dollars matthew 18 23 through 24 the man begged for forgiveness because he couldn't pay the king was filled with pity for him and he released him and forgave his debt but when the man left the king he went to a fellow servant who owed him a few thousand he grabbed him by the throat and demanded instant payment 1827-28 this was reported to the king then the king called in the man he had forgiven and said you evil servant I forgive you that tremendous debt because you pleaded with me shouldn't you have mercy on your fellow servant then the angry king sent the man to prison tortured until he had paid his entire debt that's what made my heavenly father will do to you if you refuse to forgive your brothers and sisters 1832 through 35 when we look at all that god has forgiven us it makes sense to choose to forgive others this also frees us from the torture of festering resentment we can't change what others have done to us but we can write off their debts and become willing to make amends.